The role of traditional rulers to the development of Nigerian society cannot be overemphasized. As a result, traditional authority has been sustained despite the advancement of Western culture. To keep the seat of the Agbo Jojoye of Ibasa, Ejegwegba, Uguntedo, and Satellite Town Lagos alive, and to accede to the request of the people for a king for about 17 years, Oba Fis Obi Yomi Adeyemi I has been sworn in as the new Oba. Present at the nine day coronation ceremony were traditional rulers, dignitaries, friends, and residents of Oriadi LCD. Speaking at the event, Oba Fis Obi Yomi Adeyemi who expressed gratitude to God for the opportunity to serve, assured of his readiness to take the kingdom to greater heights. I want to equally extend my appreciation to all that have supported me during my struggle to ascend the truth of my forefathers. My appreciation also goes to the executive of the state, Mr. Papa Jide Olushola Sawu Olu, Commissioner for Local Government and Community Affairs, Honorable Dr. Wale Ahmed. This vote of thanks will not be incomplete. Will be incomplete if I fail to acknowledge the effort of my honorable chairman, Amy Ramutala to Akiola Azan, the executive chairman of the LCDA. May God continue to strengthen your efforts. The chairman of Oriade LCD, Ramutalai Akinlola San, who was also present to grace the occasion, expressed hope that the reign of Oba Fis, Oriyomi Adeyemi, will bring more development to the area. It is quite almost 18 years ago that the late Oba left the throne. So, 18 years, by October it will be 18 years that we lost our yoga. I am delighted that today, being the executive chairman of the local government, I give glory to God that it was, I witnessed it. I was one that signed for it. I give glory to God. Like it meant if Azanejegun being a peace area, it should maintain the peace and harmony of the place. We don't want any violence, any crisis. Ejegun and Ipasa has been so peace, already has been so peace, and we want that peace to continue. And I wish him long life and prosperity on the throne. Traditional rulers present at the ceremony also expressed delight over the elected Oba with an assurance of maximum support geared towards making his dreams for the kingdom a reality. The ordained uh, king of Kabyos uh, of this place has been a friend for a very long time and I was happy that it was me. I mean, finally, he, be he became the Oba of Ijegu. So I, I came here today to come and felicitate with him. I'm very happy about his uh, kingship. I, it's, it's long expected and eventually he becomes the king. I'm very happy to be here. I'm happy for the Ijegun, Ijegun Ibasa. I'm happy for them, the, all the people of Ijegun Ibasa. I'm happy for them that eventually the man they want to be the king of this town eventually become the king of this town. And I wish them uh, success in everything the man do in future. They should cooperate with him and I hope with this uh, level of uh, 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 education, exposure and education, it will lead Ijegu uh, Ibasa uh, to a better life, there will be a better life for the people of Ijegu Ibasa people. Please, they should start to cooperate with him as from this moment on. Because I think no buy, the land when you are to get out, when the logo, to your loan, buy a shop at the, a fish or yummy, she to sorry at the agbojo joy, one, sorry or bye I'm very excited and I give all glory to God for this great opportunity of giving my father or uh, this great opportunity has given my father to rule this very 
lo lovely and wonderful land of Ibasa, Nijegunwekba. I want to say that you guys should please cooperate with my dad during his reign as king in Ibasa land. And I really appreciate your, like, your cooperation because unity is peace and um, it makes governance easy for all of us. With this new development, it is apparent that more developmental activities will spring up in the LCDA.